Hey guys, it's Chris. From a snake so big it caused an earthquake to the largest animal in all of America, here are 10 surprisingly big animals that you won't believe. Number 10. The Giant Manta Ray one of the biggest animals that you definitely wouldn't expect to be quite so large is the giant manta ray. This is the largest ray in the entire world, with a maximum wingspan of up to 29 feet. And no, the giant manta ray does not have wings, but it does have wing-like pectoral fins which it uses to glide through the ocean. The giant manta ray is a slow animal, sparsely distributed across the globe. It mainly eats zooplankton, and even though it's so huge, the manta ray is relatively harmless. These are different from the more deadly stingrays that are out there, as these gentle giants don't have the ability to kill a person with a strike directly at the heart. However, one of these monsters could really easily drag you underwater and smother you if you bothered it enough. A single adult manta ray can grow to be 5,300 pounds, and they also live extremely long lives in the ocean up to 40 years. But what's really interesting is the reproduction rate of the giant manta ray. For such large beasts, a single manta ray will only give birth to a single pup every two to three years. Plus, the gestation rate is about a year long. This means they have a more difficult time reproducing than other giant animals. Number 9. Elephant Seals Elephant seals are huge. Believe it or not, they're even bigger than walruses. According to the Scientific American, the largest elephant seal was recorded at being somewhere around 21 feet long, with a weight of over 8,800 pounds. This is a monstrous size, especially when considering the other fantastic qualities of the elephant seal. For example, the inflatable proboscis is quite a magnificent sight. The proboscis is basically a modified snout, completely unique to the males of the species. Elephant seals are also extremely noisy beasts. Males will roar and make horrifying gargling noises that sound a lot like a dying engine, but especially during mating season. Apparently, these noises are appealing to the female elephant seals. And what's even more disturbing about the giant elephant seal is that every year these animals undergo an unusual molt. They shed all of their hair sometime between November and March which reveals a rather ugly skin that is dry, cracked, and often scaly. And their skin is thick. The skin of a giant elephant seal can be almost two inches thick. It'd be like wearing the skin of nearly 20 humans. And that's a really gross thing to think about. Number 8. Nomura's Jellyfish When you think about jellyfish, you probably think about tiny, translucent blobs of jelly floating through the ocean. But there is one jellyfish that you'll be surprised to find out can grow to be about the size of an African lion. It's called the Nomura's Jellyfish, and it's a certifiable monster. What's even more incredible than its size is just how quickly it grows. In the span of less than a year, this jellyfish will grow from a tiny grain of rice to being bigger than any person on Earth. And while its weight is definitely impressive, its length is even more impressive. The Nomura's jellyfish will span at least two yards in length, and it maintains its enormous size by greedily feeding on all the small plankton it can find, scarfing them down using its hundreds of microscopic mouths. This jellyfish is an anomaly in nature. It's completely protected by predators thanks to tiny little poisonous barbs all over its gelatinous body. If you were to be stung by this jellyfish, it could result in death. What's the biggest jellyfish you've ever encountered? A small one on the beach or something a lot more intimidating? There's lots of giant jellyfish out there that only occasionally come into contact with humans. So tell me about your experience with jellies in the comments below, especially if you've seen a huge one. Then be sure to subscribe to World List for more awesome videos just like this one. Number 7. Earthquake Snake You may have heard a story recently in which a massive snake caused an earthquake in China. You may also have seen the image of what appears to be a massive green snake slithering down a dirt road, crowded by hundreds of people. But if you look hard at this image, you'll realize it's a total fake. The snake is very clearly photoshopped into the picture. And to be quite honest, there's no snake on Earth this big. The largest snakes on our planet are anacondas, and they only grow to be about 30 feet long at maximum. They also only live in South America. But there is good news. If you're feeling annoyed by seeing these photoshopped images online and gullibly clicking on them, you'll be happy to know that the guy who made the image got some serious karma. According to Asia One, the man was detained for manipulating the image and spreading the rumors. 
The earthquake that happened in China was very real, and 13 people were killed because of it. The man who photoshopped the image also claimed that a giant dragon caused the earthquake. This made such a big stink that the authorities decided to detain him for upsetting the public. Now oh, that's some good karma. Could you imagine someone being arrested for creating false images or memes? I guess when the consequences are this deadly, I suppose it makes some sense in some situations. Number 6. Japanese Giant Salamander If you've ever lived in North America and gone into the forest, chances are you've seen a salamander scurrying through the leaves on the forest floor. These critters are tiny, slippery, and very, very cool. But you might be surprised to know that there are giant salamanders living in the world that are about the size of a small dog. The Chinese giant salamander is by far the largest, but there's also the Japanese giant salamander, the second largest salamander species on the planet. These amphibians have been lurking in the fast-flowing streams of Japan for thousands and millions of years. They're basically dinosaurs. And they have some remarkable superpowers. The Japanese giant salamander is able to regrow skin, bone, and lost limbs. They can grow to be around 5 feet in length and weigh up to 55 pounds. They're also native to Japan, not found in any other country in the world. But because the giant salamander is ranked as near threatened, chances are they could become extinct in the future. They're at risk because of habitat destruction and, of course, climate change. According to the National Zoo, Japanese giant salamanders function much like other salamanders in that they literally breathe through their skin. Salamanders are some of the most interesting animals on Earth, and it would be a true tragedy if we were to lose the biggest of them. Number 5. The American Bison did you know that the American bison is the largest mammal in all of North America? In prehistoric times, millions of these animals roamed all throughout the vast plains and grasslands from Alaska to Mexico. They lived in the Great Basin of Nevada and all the way into the Appalachian Mountains. But by the late part of the 1800s, only a few hundred bison were left in the United States, after European settlers killed pretty much all of them. Today, there are great conservation efforts being done to maintain a stable population of these majestic beasts, and there are tens of thousands of them living across the continent. A male bison can weigh at least 2,000 pounds and stand about 6 feet tall. If you were to stand next to a bison, you probably couldn't even see over its back. These are the closest things to elephants we have in North America. And you might be wondering about the buffalo. What's the difference between a bison and a buffalo? And the truth is, there's no difference. The bison and the buffalo are the same animal. It's just that the scientific name is bison. Buffalo is actually slang, and most historians agree that the term buffalo came from the French word for beef, which is boeuf. Somehow, that became the most popular term for the animal, and even lent its name to the large city in upstate New York. Bison New York just kinda doesn't quite have the same ring to it. Number 4. The Goliath Frog the American bison is certainly a giant, but the Goliath frog is a giant in its own swampy world. This is the largest frog on the entire planet. A Goliath frog tadpole is roughly the same size as any other average frog tadpole. The difference is that Goliath frogs will just keep growing. They grow and grow and continue to grow until they've reached the size of a small house cat. The Goliath frog even looks like any other frog, it's just really giant. It takes about 12 months for the frog to mature to its full size, at which point it can be over a foot long and over 7 pounds. Also, the Goliath frog is able to jump roughly 10 feet forward. So good luck trying to catch one of those frogs in your butterfly net. According to the San Diego Zoo, these monstrous amphibians only live near the equator in western Africa. They eat insects, fish, and other frogs. And apparently, a researcher even once found a half-digested bat inside the belly of a goliath frog. Number 3. The Blackiston's Fish Owl Have you ever heard of a fish owl? If not, be prepared to be surprised. The Blackiston's Fish Owl is the largest living species of owl that we have on the planet. The creature looks like a weird mix between a puffy barn owl and a predatory eagle. The male can weigh up to 8 pounds, while the female can grow to be over 10 pounds. Female owls are typically 25% larger than their male counterparts. As an endangered bird, the Blackiston's fish owl is seldomly seen. It lives primarily throughout the remote region of eastern Russia and in the north of Japan, Korea, and China, and it's unclear how many are left in the wild. Some estimates place their numbers between 1,500 and 3,500, but nobody really knows for sure. What's really fascinating about fish owls is that they have evolved into specialized hunters. And they specialize in hunting fish, meaning they must stay close to rivers and streams where food is available. And this is unlike other owls, which can easily hunt for mice and other small rodents that are plentiful throughout the forest. Number 2. 
giant African snail. Snails are kind of gross. Let's just get that out of the way first. Whether you have slimy snails eating all the vegetables in your garden or ruining your aquarium, snails are gross and often annoying. And if the idea of touching one of these slimy monsters freaks you out, you might want to close your eyes. The next surprisingly large animal is the giant African snail, which is the largest terrestrial mollusk ever discovered. The shell of the giant African snail can be about 8 inches long. While it's obviously not as large as an elephant or a bison, it's pretty impressive for a mollusk. But let's talk about the diet of the giant African snail. It's large enough to cover most of your hand, and it has an appetite like no other animal on Earth. The giant African snail will eat a variety of over 500 different types of plants. Fruits, vegetables, houseplants, and anything else. They can wipe out a small farm overnight and leave nothing but slimy snail poop in their wake. Number 1. Chan's Mega Stick We've all seen a stick bug before. These strange bugs are tiny and look just like sticks, making them extremely difficult to find out in the wilderness. But there's actually something called the Chan's Mega Stick, and it's the biggest stick bug on Earth with a possible length of up to 22 inches. It's still extremely elusive, just like any average stick bug. The big difference is that the Chan's Mega Stick is nearly two feet long. It has a slender body and is able to blend in perfectly with sticks and leaves. This enormous stick bug was first discovered by a local villager in Malaysia back in 1989. The largest specimen discovered so far is now located at the Natural History Museum in London. Because the insect is so rare and so strange, nearly nothing is known about its biology or its lifestyle. Scientists do know that the Chan's Mega Stick lives extremely high in the canopies of tropical rainforests, making more specimens basically impossible to find. What do you think of these giant creatures? Let me know your thoughts in the comments and be sure to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you again soon for another fantastic video.